So in Sketch Engine, once you log in, you will see uh, the corpora that uh, you have on your account and to create a new corpus, you can click on create new corpus. Uh, but um, you can also, of course, choose from the um, available corpora in Sketch Engine. There are uh, a large number of uh, mono and multilingual corpora uh, at your disposal. If you're creating a corpus, you will first provide a name, then you will specify the language of this corpus uh, and click Create. Uh, now, first, uh, we would like to upload some files that we have already uh, to add to our Crystallogy corpus. Uh, you have to add each file in turn, and then you can see a preview of that file. Uh, and upon clicking Finish, the file will be processed, which means it will be converted into a vertical format. Uh, and then you can uh, choose a new file. You can of course add as many files you want uh, and the procedure is uh, the same. Uh, now let's say that you would like to amend your corpus with some text from the internet. Um, there is a very um, nice facility in Sketch Engine called Web Bootcat where you can enter uh, seed words. So you basically enter the search terms for uh, your um, uh, query and the Sketch Engine will look for text uh, on the web containing these uh, three uh, terms. So if you're looking for multi-word expressions, you should put them in uh, quotation marks. Uh, and then once you get the URLs, uh, you can go through them and uh, tick or untick the ones that you would like to include. Once we are satisfied with the selection, we can click Next. Uh, and the corpus will be processed, so these websites uh, will be uh, copied and cleaned, uh, all HTML tags will be removed, and uh, the corpus uh, will also be compiled in the sense that a part of speech tagging and lemmatization are performed and uh, word sketches are uh, compiled. Uh, once, uh, so here you can now see the result. Uh, we have uh, our two texts and we also have the web corpus. Um, if you would like to add metadata to your text, you can click on the little tag and, um, and then add attributes. For example, you want to specify the author uh, of uh, each text or the year or title and this is handy if you would at a later stage like to use subcorpora uh, in Sketch Engine or uh, uh, you would like to compare different text types. Uh, at any point you can uh, look at the corpus info tab which will show you the um, basic statistical information about your corpus so currently we have a corpus of just over 400,000 tokens and 320,000 words uh, and you can see the tags uh, uh, used and the size of the lexicon and other uh, basic information.